It's about 4.38 in the morning. I start by completing the 500 push-ups I do every day. Then I move into rereading The Great Gatsby before finally correctly solving 65 leak code questions. Difficulty hard. All right, we're back. By popular demand this time, I have for you guys the best day in the life vlog on YouTube ever and forever. It takes a lot of effort to make these vlogs, so please comment, share, like, subscribe, all of that. Um, and if you want to schedule a meeting with me, there's a link below, mitunlock.com. So today is Monday, that means I have every class except electronics. The schedule is going to be 9.30 a.m. I'm going to have Venture Engineering. Then at 1 p.m. I'm going to have Espanol. 2 p.m. I have Probability Math Class. 3 p.m. I got Dynamical Systems Modeling. And then at 7.30 I have Volleyball. Today I'm also going to be going to Barker Engineering Library. So watch the whole video, you get some insider look on the inside of the dome. So, tight schedule. In Venture Engineering, we started a Lamborghini dealership. We bought a $75,000 Italian coffee machine, we ran ads in the newspapers, and hired the best technicians. But the problem was, for 15 weeks, we had no customers. Then, on the 16th week, a Volvo pulls up and says, I need someone reliable to fix my car, and I trust you guys will do it correctly. So I'll pay you $1,000 right now to fix it at your dealership. Do you take the money? Comment below what you think is the right answer. So I'm back from Venture Engineering now. I have about two hours till my Spanish class. I'm going to take a meeting real quick with one of my students who I'm helping with his college applications. Then I'm going to work on the PSET for my probability math class. And then I'm going to have lunch and I'll head to the library to get the textbook. So here is, this is the first piece of the year. The problem I'm working on is number two. Of the students in a class, 60% are geniuses, 70% love chocolate, and 25% are neither. Determine the probability that a randomly selected student is a genius or a chocolate lover, but not both. If you answer this correctly in the comment section below, I will respond to you.
sixth, I had Spanish class. We learned about telling time. Then in probability class, we learned about independence of events. In systems, we learned about some very complicated first order differential equation stuff. Lastly, before volleyball, I wanted to go to office hours real quick to get some help on the P set. I made my way all the way from building 1 to building 36, but it was worth it because the TA was really good. On my way back, I noticed the classic MIT slogan about fire hoses and contemplated the truth of this statement. Finally, I take my studying to the banana lounge where I finish up some work and grab a perfectly yellow banana. Grab a quick dinner before heading out to practice. the glaze bro like oh my god so now that the day is winding down i wanted to take a minute to talk about the new kind of network i'm building for you guys my viewers i want to be able to help first generation low income middle income students get into top tier institutions that is going to be the focus of this channel from now on i've started by making a community where students network with each other and i hop on monthly group calls to help my students with college applications scholarships etc. And of course, I'm also offering the one-on-one -on -one consulting right now, but I'm figuring out what my students actually need. So this may change and I'm looking for different areas to expand into. Ultimately, I wanted this channel to have a bigger purpose behind it. And this is how I want to help and give back. So you can go ahead and join this network, this community in the description below. If you can't afford the cost for any reason, because this is a new endeavor, I want you to just reach out to me and I'll figure out a way to get you the help you need. Thank you all for watching this video. Now go ahead and take a moment to like, subscribe, share, and comment down below something. I left a few hints throughout the video of things you could comment. Um, and I, I love seeing your comments. I'm going to reply to you. Now, if you're interested in some of the resources MIT has for entrepreneurship, go ahead and click on this video right here. You'd be surprised at some of the things that MIT offers. Now, I'll catch you in the next one.